You can calculate compound interest on a calculator or a phone. The trick is to make sure that you do your exponent first. So you want to do 1.06 to the fifth power and then multiply by 3000. When calculating compound interest, you want to type in your base first, your 1.06, and then you're looking for your exponent. And this is called the caret. So you're going to type in your base and then click on this button right here. So here I am clicking on this button. And what will happen is it will the little carrot will show up right here. So it's telling you the up arrow. It's saying I'm ready for my exponent. Now you're going to type in your exponent of 5. It was right here, so this is where we type it in. And then you're going to hit Enter. When you hit Enter, you're going to have some long number right here. Don't round it here. Just leave it in your calculator. And now you're going to hit multiply because now you're going to want to multiply by your 3000, your principal. And here's your multiplication button right here. And this is kind of neat. Do you see it says answer times? This is just saying take that really long number, whatever the answer was, and multiply it by whatever I type in. So in this case, I'm going to take the answer times my principal, which was 3000. I hit enter again and it comes up with my amount of interest plus principal. Now at this point you need to recognize that you have to round here. Our money only goes to the pennies, the hundredths place, so look at the six behind it. It tells this seven to go up, which tells us our answer here is four thousand fourteen and sixty-eight cents. If you're working on an iPhone, you're going to do the same thing basically. You're going to have to type in your 1.06 first, and then in, you're not looking for a carrot, you're looking for this X to the Y button. So 1.06, type in X to the Y, and then type in your 5. When you hit Enter, you will get your same long number right there. And don't, don't clear it around it, just leave it in there, and then hit Times your principal. So times 3000, hit enter right here, and when you hit enter you should come back up with that same 4014 and 68 cents. Again, don't forget to round right here to the pennies.